Hey church, happy Saturday. Happy last day of October. Pastor Zach here, and I just wanted to challenge you and encourage you with something today. Many of us have that one friend who just won't come to church. We all we want to see people come to know Jesus. We want to see lost people found. We want to see revival happen in our city. But we all have that one friend, that family member, that work colleague, that no matter how many times we invite them to church, they just won't come. And I want you to picture like this. Using church is a tool for people coming to know Jesus, much like a hammer is a tool for building a house or for a different project. And a hammer is a great tool when the hammer is the tool that's necessary. It's a great tool to use. That There's no other tool that can get the job done like a hammer can get the job done. But a hammer is not the only tool that we use. There's some jobs where maybe a drill is the tool that we need to use. And a drill can do lots of things that a hammer cannot do. Coming to church, let's say, is the hammer. And sometimes that tool, it's a great tool and it gets the job done. But sometimes that's not the tool for the job. There's some people who just will never walk into the door of the church. So how can lost people come to know Jesus if they don't come to the church? It's through you. The place that you're at, the family you're in, the neighborhood you live in, that is your mission field. That is your place where, where people can come to know Jesus through you. So what does that look like? That's you inviting them into your house. That's you uh, sharing about Jesus. That's you talking about what God's doing in your life. That's what we post on social media. That's what we don't post on social media. We are in a place on purpose for a purpose. And, and we need to move past using just one tool that, that, we, that we've seen that tool work before, but maybe it's not working now. Now the church, it's great. And we want to encourage people to come to church. It's a place where people can come and feel at home and come to know Jesus. But like I said, sometimes there's just people who won't come into the church. So how can you this week be the church to someone who doesn't know Jesus? How can you be the church at your workplace, at your school, in your family, in your neighborhood? Because lost people need to hear about Jesus. I hope that that challenges you, that that encourages you, and that we can see people come to know Jesus through you. Have a great day.